Good Monday morning. It's the Mixed Morning Briefing presented by Toyota of Cleveland. I'm Steve Hartline. In the news today, as you probably know by now, the third vaccine to fight COVID-19 was approved by the FDA over the weekend, Johnson & Johnson. And the state's top health commissioner, Dr. Lisa Piercy, said that the, the Johnson & Johnson vaccine could be in Tennessee as early as today the third vaccine in the fight against COVID-19. Also in the news, the Bradley County Republican Party held their reorganization meeting on Saturday at Okoy Middle School and elected new officers. They include the new chairwoman of the Bradley County Republican Party, Emily Beatty Hildebrand as the new chair. Also Hunter Shamblin is the new vice chair. Joshua Rogers, the secretary, David Benton, treasurer, Jean Clayton, vice secretary, and Dr. John Stanberry as the vice treasurer. And don't forget the Lee University Symphonic Band will hold their spring concert Tuesday night. It will be held at 7.30 at the Lee Con Center under the direction of Professor Dr. Mark Bailey. At the program, they'll feature classic music from the concert band repertoire, such as Sousa, Kurnow, and Reed, as well as worship selections that feature all of the Lee University Symphonic Band's musicians. That's our mixed morning briefing presented by Toyota of Cleveland. Sign up for the all new Mix News Alert emails at mymix1041.com and some very important government meetings. You can follow those there as well, also presented by Toyota of Cleveland. I'm Steve Hartline reporting.